Ah, done for today, 10 p.m. Been working all day. Done three uploads today, so I'm really happy with myself. Just want to relax a little bit, you know. <laughs> I love my life. I'm working so hard, man. What? What? You expect me to do a video on this? Hey? After working all day? Let me just eat this first, okay? What's going on guys? Dorko back again. Hope you're fantastic today and welcome back to another FNAF news video. Today, straight after I uploaded another video, which is very good by the way. Make sure to check out my uploads for today, please. Please don't just watch this one and ignore my other ones for today, please. Just watch my other ones, please. Scott has revealed the book cover for the third and final book in the Five Nights at Freddy's book franchise. This is on the Barnes and Noble website, a very legit bookstore, which is where I buy a lot of my books from because most of the FNAF books have been delayed in the UK, so I've used Barnes and Noble to get my books. So this is a very legit website. And here is the cover, guys. Five Nights at Freddy's, the fourth closet. Don't look at me, I don't freaking know what that's about. I honestly don't know, the fourth closet. I don't know. Um, something hidden, maybe, hidden in the closet. Um, but to me, I'm going to talk about my guess on what the plot's going to be. Thank you to the art in the background, which is Funtime Freddy. So this is Funtime Freddy from Sister Location. The only difference with this one is that it doesn't have any colour. It's literally just black and white. And it has obviously the red uh, lens flare to make it look creepy. But it's interesting how it doesn't have any colour. We don't know whether that's significant or not. My guess is that maybe it hasn't been painted yet. Um, it's just for the effect for the front cover. I don't know. But it's definitely Funtime Freddy. I've looked at the models. That is Funtime Freddy. And that's from Sister Location. Interestingly as well, the background behind Funtime Freddy is like technology. It looks like a circuit board. Do you know what I mean? And it's blue. And like blueprints. Do you know what I mean? Um, so I, again, it's, it, to me it feel, feels like a link back to Sister Location. Blueprints, technology, higher technology... Um, advancement in William Afton's designs. I feel like that's what it's trying to show here. Also, I've just realised the title, The Fourth Closet, is golden. It's like a gold colour, which is very significant with Golden Freddy and Springtrap. And as we know, spoiler alert! In the second book, it's revealed that William Afton is still alive inside of Springtrap. At the ending of The Twisted Ones, um, Charlie meets with Springtrap and they both have a little bit of a battle and the whole place starts to collapse. Charlie is just about to escape until Charlie gets trapped inside the Freddy stomach and apparently dies. We don't know what's happened to Charlie. We don't know what's happened with Springtrap. We also know that a lady comes out of a car when the rest of the group are inside the diner and we still don't know who that is. So the Twisted Ones was left at a cliffhanger. Um, I can't really guess what the third book's going to be about, plot-wise. I just know it might be about Sister Location and the Funtime Animatronics. And I definitely feel like Springtrap's still alive because he escapes through the little tunnel um, when he meets with Charlie. Uh, we don't know whether Charlie's alive or not, but my guess is that Charlie will be alive. And I'm going to guess the woman that comes out of the car is either Charlie's mother or the auntie. Those are my only guesses. But it has been a while since we've talked about the Twisted One, guys. So if you don't really know about the other books, I would advise you to read them because this book comes out in June. Um, June the 26th, I think, in 2018. So uh, a few more months. Or you can check out my summary videos. I make summaries on both of the books and my reviews and opinions on them. So you can check those out as well. But yeah, that's honestly it. Um, if you guys have got any suggestions, let me know in the comment section, please, because I'd love to know your thoughts. Um, to summarise, it's Funtime Freddy, but an uncoloured Funtime Freddy. It's called The Fourth Closet. The Fourth Closet is in golden text, and there is a blue circuit board behind Funtime Freddy. I feel like it's going to be based around Sister Location. Springtrap William Afton is going to return 
and I feel like Charlie will still be alive or possessed, like he's possessing an animatronic or something. As we know from FNAF 6, um, William Afton's very good at experimenting um, and giving life to the animatronics through like a serum. Um, so yeah, I feel like Charlie might possess an animatronic, maybe Funtime Freddy in this book. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, it's not that far away guys, and we've still got this book, and we're still waiting on what the office is going to look like in the FNAF 6 Ultimate Custom Night. So, I'm very excited. But I'm not going to make it 10 minutes long to get some lovely revenue, uh, because I can't really talk about much more. And I don't want to just blabber on. So please leave a like if you enjoyed this news and you are excited for the third book. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. And please make sure to check out my uploads for today. Like I said, I've uploaded two really good videos. Uh, but when, FNAF, like when I make a FNAF news video, obviously people are going to come here and maybe ignore my other uploads. So please check them out. You won't be disappointed. If you are, just dislike them. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> Lots of love. Thank you for watching. The fourth closet is coming. And I have no idea what it's about. <laughs> Goodbye.